My name is Mariah. I'm 17. My name is Quaylude. I'm 17. My name is Elliot Alves. I'm 16. Layson, and I am 10, almost 11. My name is La Marquita Leach, and I'm 23 years old. Uh, my name is Deshaya the Great, the GOAT, you know. Uh, nah, I'm Deshaya. And I am 18. So my name is Serana Robinson, and I roll as a partner with Dancing and Creatives to bring music um, and to bring to storytelling to our community. Right, so I think it was a really dope collaboration. It was, it was truly 50-50. It was like, for me, I, I specialize in like working with youth, youth development, and knowing how to uplift the youth. And Daniel and Dan Sand Creatives, they know how to bring the music to it. Uh, they know how to bring the live, the action, um, and the actual mixtapes to the youth. Um, so that's how we partnered up. I'd say they brought a lot of the music, the production, the information, the things that we learned. Um, and that was just a little bridge to help connect the kids to them. Um, they're, they're very well with the youth as well, but their main uh, line is music. So I was there to be that bridge um, to just help put it all together for them. The process was pretty, it's very like natural. We had Zoom meetings and we would talk, I would talk with Daniel Serrano, multiple other people, and sometimes other artists, kids my age, would show up on the Zoom and I guess I could get some input from them and hear about their story or, you know, why they're writing music, what kind of music they write, maybe a little bit of the music they write. Everyone just putting down what they truly think is creative and really working together, like giving each other feedback to get stuff done or like what they think will be the best final product. I didn't start by picking a beat. Like I started by making a poem and then it turned into a rap because like <laughs> I had to find a beat to go with it and I didn't know what rhythm to use until somebody came on with the beat. Like maybe it was Daniel. <laughs> it was just like this beat go perfect with your song. And I guess it went with the theme too, so. I liked hearing other people's music that they created. I liked working with everyone and creating my own. Now that I made a rap to go with the song, I actually like it because it's inspiring. I didn't even know I can be inspired. <laughs> I felt like I'm not the only one that's my age in writing music. And so I have like this whole, this whole other bunch of people that I can be like, I relate to them and they relate to me so they understand like my struggles and also just what it's like. Cause it helps, it helps to find a coping mechanism. It helps to write your feelings down. It helps to say your feelings. It helps to, if you wanna put it in poetry or writing or rapping or singing, anything. It just helps cause you know, it's just another way to not build things up. You know, have stuff build up inside of you. I like this mixtape project because um, it's new. It's like, um, it's the reason to get out the house. I like doing this music video. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. So I think for me, it really, honestly, it helped me connect with them better. I think like really understanding what the youth go through through that music is something that like we should do a lot more of because um, it's really hard to storytell in general. So if a youth can do that through the music, I feel like that's just a way for them to connect. Something that I really can look back on and be like, this is something that set me off or set something that really taught me a lot. Um, I've been blessed and privileged to be a, a part of such uh, an inspirational movement. Uh, I definitely think that I was meant to do this um, and I couldn't be more blessed to be a part of now a strong built community that has come around me and given me nothing but hope and guidance and more inspiration and told me the things that I can accomplish. Now I'll be writing. I'll just write some more. So hopefully I'll come up with a new rap. Thank you. <laughs>